Hmm. Let's see what this one does. I can see people's locations. Well, this day is going to be interesting. What pill did you choose? The purple one. What does it do? I can see people's locations. Can you see where our teacher is? He didn't come to sure. school today. Where's our teacher? It says at Christine's house. Uh, Christine is our principal. Do you think they're doing a thing? I really don't want to know. Hey, I heard you can see people's locations. Does it work on items too? Because I forgot where I put my phone. I don't phone. know, but I can try. Where's Sarah's phone? Looks like it's in your pocket. Oh, I'm so dumb. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey sis, how's school? Did you get your power yet? Yeah, I can see people's locations. Cool, can you see where mom is? She didn't come back from work. No. Where's mom? So, where is she? Three, two, one. So, what did I get? Uh oh. What? You got green. Green? What the hell does green mean? I don't know, but make sure you cover it up. Why is everyone screaming? The government has given people green marks to decrease overpopulation. They're killing everyone with green marks. This can't be true. Look around you. I need to go. I'm gonna die. I have a green mark. What am I gonna do? Attention everyone. Please go straight to the main hall for mark checks. They're gonna find out I faked my mark. Are you okay? You look worried. Yeah, I'm fine. I have a purple mark anyways. It's still purple, right? Yes, just stop stressing. Amora, it's your turn. Move your hair, please. Error, looks like you faked your mark. No, 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 please! Can't be that bad. Eight times? Damn. Amara, how many times did you dodge death? Eight times. Eight times, that's a lot. I know, right? Looks like there's a lot of people that are trying to get me killed. I can't believe Sam made us run for 30 minutes straight. Do you need some water? No thanks, I have my own. Seriously? What? I know you put poison in that bottle. I thought we were friends. I can't believe my own friend tried to kill me. Who can I even trust? Amara, someone's calling you. Why do you even have my phone? Give it to me. Hello? You need to come home right now. Coming. I have to go. Wait, you can't go. Who are you to tell me what I can and can't do? What are you doing? You can't just lock me in here. I'll explain everything later. Look up. How did you? Okay, so basically, the story is, look up. How did you? Okay, so the story is, I woke up this morning and I was able to look into people's So, future. what does that have to do with anything? Are you going to wait till I finish speaking? Go on. Your stepdad is trying to kill you. What are you talking about? Why would he want to do that? I don't know. All I know is you can't go home. He's dangerous. So why would my mom tell me to go home? He probably told her to say that. It's all part of his plan. What am I supposed to do now? There's only one way. You have to kill him before he kills you. I can't do that. I'll go to prison. Not if it's self-defense. This is ridiculous. I'm going home. I wonder what my cats will be today. I can hear men's thoughts. Well, this day is going to be interesting. Morning. Thanks for letting me sleep over last night. Can I sleep over tonight? Yeah, too? of course. Morning, guys. Morning, Dad. Gosh, I wish Amara would just leave the room so that me and her best friend could do whatever we've been doing all night again. You guys ready for school? What's wrong? You look shocked. I, um, you need to get out of my house right now. But what did I- I said leave. Sir, can I get help with this question? Of course. I wish you would wear short skirts. That way teacher will be more excited. You? Aren't you like 74? Yeah, why? Just give me my paper back. This day's been so weird. Hey, Amara. Hey, Jake. I just ate a rat and it was so delicious. Finally, at least this day is over. I wonder what I'm going to get tomorrow. Know the contents of a drawer or a fridge? I'd like to know what people have in the fridge. It smells good. What are you cooking? How did you know I was cooking? I know, you're cooking a cake. My power is that I can see what's in someone's fridge. Hi guys, what did you have for lunch today? I didn't eat anything. My mom said we don't have oh, money. you're telling the truth because your fridge has nothing. You don't have to ask me. I only eat expensive food. You don't need to lie. I know that you eat cheap meat. What? How did you because know Because I can see what everyone has in the fridge. That's so cool. Hello, everyone. I brought you guys free food today. Really? Thank you, miss. I'm starving. Wait, is she being serious? Our teacher never gives out anything for free. I'm sure you'll charge us for the food later. No, I promise. I'm doing this for charity, but you can only take one each. Okay. Thank you. Why can't I see what our teacher has in our fridge? If you're not going to eat that, can you give it to me? I can, yeah. I didn't really like the smell of it. It smells a bit weird. Why didn't you offer it to me first?
How strange. Why is everyone in class like this? Tomorrow I'll bring more food again, so don't bring lunch, okay? How do you cook if you don't have a fridge? What are you talking about, young lady? My fridge is full. Stop talking, otherwise she won't give us free food anymore. Calm down, I'll always bring free food. Miss, wait, don't go away. What is it? I want to help you prepare for the food tomorrow. Oh no, no need, I don't have money to pay. I didn't ask for money, I don't even want a salary, I just want to help you. That's the only way for me to find out what's wrong. Hmm, okay, come to my house today at midnight. How? Does it have to be midnight? Why? You'll see when you get there. The map is saying that it's here, but how come I can't see the teacher? I'll just go this way. Miss? Huh? Why are there so many refrigerators? One, two, three, four, five. What's in there? I have to check. There's so many eggs in here. It smells weird. I better break this. No, wait. Don't do it. Same clothes or same hair as my soulmate. I don't want my hair to look like a boy, so same clothes. Uh, why are you wearing a Fortnite hoodie? Because my soulmate probably likes Fortnite and I have to wear the same clothes as him. His clothes are ugly. That means he's not from a rich family. I don't know. We'll see. Why isn't anyone wearing the same clothes as me? Amara, the clothes that you're wearing are the same as the prince. Seriously? You have to hurry to the palace now. But I don't want to go there by myself. Don't worry, I'm coming with you. Let's go. My clothes are the same as the prince. That means I'm his soulmate. The prince's soulmate has been found. Everyone gather in the hall. I should be the prince's soulmate. I'm the real one and she's a fake. Our clothes are all the same, but I have a solution. You have to join a cooking contest. A cooking contest? Yes, the one with the most delicious cooking will be my wife. Okay then, I have to hurry. Hey, I made a Christmas cupcake. I made pudding. I like both of your cooking, I can't choose. Well then, who won? I will change clothes first to prove who my soulmate is. Because me and my soulmate share outfits after all. I hope my clothes are the same as the prince. I will change clothes first to prove who my soulmate is because me and my soulmate share the same outfits after all. I hope my clothes are the same as the prince. I've changed clothes, what about you? <sighs> Looks like I've changed clothes too. Me too. Oh, I'm getting confused. Maybe the prince has two wives. This is ridiculous. There's no way I'm sharing my soulmate with someone else. I really believe that you're the prince's soulmate. But how am I going to make him believe that? You have to get rid of that girl first. By the way, where did that girl go? Looks like she went and she's planning something. You have to be prepared. Did you hear? Apparently the prince has two soulmates. I think one of them must be lying. I know, I'd hate to be in their position. I wonder what they have to say once they find out I'm his soulmate. I'm home. Honey, you left the palace. I saw what happened on the news. Yeah, I left. The prince should be my soulmate, mom. You need to show him proof. He won't believe you unless you have proof. I'll help you. You again. What are you doing here? I'm here to prove myself. And how are you going to do that? By changing my clothes. Me and my soulmate share the same outfit. So if I change my clothes, then surely his clothes will automatically change. And if that happens, I will marry the prince. Me and my soulmate share the same outfit, so if I change my clothes, then surely his will change too. And if that happens, that means I'm going to marry the prince. Okay, so all I need to do is change this outfit, right? I'll just put on this grey top, and if he's wearing the same clothes as me, that means he's my soulmate. Okay, I've changed outfits. Now I just need to find the prince. Where is he? You again! Why are you wearing the same outfit as me? I don't know, my outfits change randomly all the time. No, you're lying. You're doing this on purpose. You just want to steal the prince from me. Speaking of the prince, where is he? I don't know. I thought he was with you. Hey, have you seen the prince? Oh, you two are matching. <sighs> Answer my question. He's in that room over there. Finally, there you are. Wait, who is she? Guys, that's not what it looks like. Are you cheating on us? I can't believe it. I just met my soulmate and he's already cheating on me. Well, I don't care about this whole soulmate thing. Plus, this girl's cooking is way better than both of you. This is so weird. Why was he wearing the same outfit as us? Do you want to know why? 
Who are you? It doesn't matter. The reason why you're all wearing the same outfits is because you're all soulmates. Wait, what? Yes, but you have to pick who you want to be with. You should get the options now. Mine says I can pick between the prince or you. So does mine. Okay, I've already picked. I'm gonna pick later. Hey, just out of curiosity, who did you pick to be your soulmate? Oh, I, uh, I picked you. Wait, what? I can see someone's last drink or last meal. I think their last meal is more interesting. Mom, I'm gonna eat quickly before going to school. Oh my gosh, you ate a cockroach? Yeah, I wanted to try it. I learned how to fry it online. Do you want to try some? No, thank you. I'm going to school. Bye. Wait, before you go, here, take a couple with you so you can eat them at lunch. Whatever, mom. Thanks. It turns out all my friends are healthy because they eat vegetables all the time. Amara, what's that in your lunchbox? What kind of food is that? It looks delicious. The fried cockroaches. Do you want to try some? Sure, I've never had them before. I heard they're really good. Thank you for sharing your lunch. You're usually very stingy. I feel bad for you because you eat vegetables all the time. How do you know that I eat vegetables? Because I can see people's last meal. If that's true, can you check my last meal? Chicken liver? Gosh, you're right. But please don't tell anyone I have this power. I feel like everyone who ate your cockroach yesterday is gone. Huh? Gone? How? They didn't come to school today. Who made that cockroach? My mom, but it's impossible that she would poison my lunch. The teacher now suspects you. Luckily, I didn't try your lunch yesterday, so I'm saved. You wanted to see me, sir? Aria said you can see someone's last meal, right? But I told her not to tell anyone. Is that true, Amara? Yes, sir. Meet me at the school warehouse at 3 this afternoon. I wonder why he wants me to meet him at that exact time. Okay, sir. Why does it smell so rotten in here? You should see their last meal. Huh? Them? That's my friends who didn't show up to school today. Why do they look so pale? Everyone who ate your cockroach died. One of them, as you know, is the president's daughter. There's no way. I guarantee you my lunch wasn't poisoned. I need you to please look at their last meal. Huh? Why can't I see it? The last meal isn't appearing, sir. Okay, I'll give you three hours. If you can't prove it, you'll be found guilty and will be punished. Buy these glasses, please. They're cheap. No, thanks. I don't want to buy any glasses. But they have a great power. You won't regret it. Great power? Okay, who knows? Maybe they can help me. I'll take them. You're here, which means you can see people's last meals, right? I'll try, sir. This is your last chance. Okay, I'll put on these glasses first. So, what's the last meal? Gosh, so they really did die because of the lunch I gave them. Hello, answer me. Um, it wasn't because of me, sir. The last meal was chicken soup. Okay, now keep this a secret from everyone. So, I'm not in trouble, right, sir? No, but please keep this a secret. Yes, of course. Where did you just come from, Amara? I was just walking around the school. I'm really starting to get worried about our friends. Do you think something bad happened to them? No, I don't think so. Honey, you're back from school. Let's have lunch. I just cooked. What's our lunch this time? Cockroaches. Why? I don't know if I should eat it, but I need to find out if the reason my friends died was because of them. You don't want to eat the food? Yes, I, I do, Mom. Well, it tastes really good, doesn't mm -hmm. it? Why didn't anything happen? I'll get it. Hey, I brought you a bag filled with food. You did? I don't think I can accept this, sir. If you don't, I'll reduce your grades. Okay, I'll accept it. Why is he forcing me to take this? This is so weird. I have to find out who was responsible for what happened at school yesterday. Amara, you're finally here. Huh, Stephanie? How are you still alive? Am I in heaven? I'm still alive, and we all need your help to avoid the teacher. So you faked your death? Yes. I'm still alive, and we all need your help to avoid the teacher. Wait, so you faked your death? Yes, because... Because we wanted to save Sarah. I think she really died because she got poisoned. So you didn't die because of the lunch I gave you? No, in fact, I went to your house to ask for more food because it was so delicious. Hey, who's there? Shoot, we have to go. Thank God we got out before him seeing us. How are we supposed to save Sarah? She's the president's daughter. If he finds out she got poisoned, no one knows what he's going to do. 
You think she died because she got poisoned, right? Yes. I have to see her last meal. That's the only way I can find out. Let's go back in there. Oh, yeah, I have to use these glasses first. What's her last meal, Amara? What? What's wrong? It looks like she's eating a lot of different things. But these foods are the same as our teacher and Elisa's foods. Okay, you know what to do, right? Hey, Amara, don't you hate staying at school for this long? I should be asking you this question. You don't have any relationship with our teacher, do you? Me? No. Why do you ask? Because you two always eat the same meals. Are you really suspecting me right now? I thought you were better than this. I feel so sleepy, Mom. Amara, where have you been? It's so late. I was out with friends. Hurry up and go to bed. You have school tomorrow. What food are you making tomorrow? I'm making steak. Yes! Mom, I'm going to school. Honey, there's no school today. Just stay at home and help me clean. No school? Why? I saw the announcement on TV that the president's daughter is dead. Oh no, they found out. Why did she die? I don't know, but two of your friends got arrested because they suspect that they killed her. You mean Emma and Lily? I have to go. Quickly look for Stephanie's heart. Her heart wasn't found? No, it was stolen by someone. Sir, did you? Shh, if you report me to the police, you'll regret it. Make sure you keep it a secret. Alyssa, you have to help me. Help you with what? You ate Stephanie's heart too? I've been waiting for this moment. Me and our teacher both wanted her dead because she's a spoiled brat. What's wrong with you? You've changed so much. I'm going to tell the police. You don't have any proof. Excuse me, miss. Why are you here? We're doing an investigation. I know who killed Stephanie. It was Elisa and my teacher. I have a recording of them both confessing. I can't believe this. This is all the evidence we need. Thank you so much. You're amazing. Mom, what are these choices above my head? You have to choose between eating a shrimp and taking out your ponytails. I'm allergic to shrimp, so I'll choose to let go of my ponytails. You can't, honey. The magic ponytails from our ancestors. If you let go, bad things will happen, so just eat the shrimp. Okay, Mom. Oh, look, it's the blind girl with the ponytails. I know, right? She never does any... Are you not part. tired of talking about me all the time? Hey, the blind girl has the courage to answer now. Class, we will hold a poetry reading competition next week. Can I join, sir? How are you going to join? You're blind. You can't read. I can memorize it. I'm sorry, Amara, but you can't take part in this competition. But, sir! It's a shame. You're no use to the school. Why am I blind? Why can't I just be like the other kids at school? Hello, excuse me, I'm new. Do you know where the library is? Uh, it's in... I'm sorry, I didn't know you were blind. That's okay. I'm Chris, by the way. I'm Amara. Look, it's the blind girl. Let's have some fun. Hey, pony, Give hey. it back! It's right here, take it. <laughs> She's so stupid. Hey, stop. You guys are really mean. Who the hell are you? You don't need to get involved. He's kind of handsome, you know. Do you want to be friends? I don't want to be friends with evil people like you. Ugh, he's so arrogant. Amara, let's go. Thanks, Chris, for helping me. That's okay. I'm your new friend, after all. Wow, I have a friend. You really don't have any other friends? No, they all think I'm weird because I'm blind. They call me Blind Pony. Calm down. From now on, I'll always be on your side. My throat feels weird. What's wrong? Because my mom made me eat shrimps and I'm allergic to it. It was either that or I had to let go of my ponytails. Why don't you let it loose? She says something bad will happen if I do. I'm curious. Why don't we try to remove the ponytail? No, we can't do that. That's risky. What if you're blind because of the ponytails? What? No, that's crazy. I've been blind ever since I was a child, Chris. But you've also had those ponytails since you were oh, a child. Oh, you're right. Just take them off, Amara. I'll take care of you. I guess it's worth a try. Chris? Amara, can you see? Yes, I never thought I'd be able to see again. But it's weird. Why has my mom made me blind all this time? There must be a reason. Did your mom ever give you anything else? Mom makes me apple juice every day, but it tastes weird. Well, make sure you don't drink that apple juice anymore. We don't know what's behind all of this. Okay, Chris. Mom, I'm home. Honey, I missed you. You didn't take off your pigtails, did you? No, Mom. Good, honey. 
Honey, I made you apple juice. Drink it. Okay. Hurry up. It will soon be afternoon. Mom, I'm going to a friend's house, okay? Be careful. Did you drink the apple juice? Yes, Mom. Look, there's the blind girl again, but why is her hair down? Hey, guys, I can finally see you. Why aren't you blind? I'm normal now. Oh, so you've been fooling us all this time? Yeah, she only did it for the attention. You freak. Chris, where are you? Hey, Amara, sorry I'm late. Are you okay? What's that drink? This is the apple juice I've been talking about. I've been drinking it ever since I was a kid. That doesn't seem like apple juice to me. The color is off. What color is apple juice supposed to be like? Yellowish. From now on, you have to be careful with your mom. Come to my house. I want you to meet my dad. Okay. Dad, this is my friend. Do you know what that drink is? Huh? Where did you get this drink from? My mom gave it to me. That drink isn't just a normal drink. This drink is... This drink is prohibited. It cannot be drunk. There used to be only one person who could make this drink. People tried to get the recipe, but it was impossible. Why was it impossible? May I know what your mom's name is? Grace. Grace? She was my father's assistant. She's the only one who can make that potion. The effect of that potion made people forget their memories. Then what should we do, Dad, so that her memory can come back? You have to make your mom drink this. Once she does, you'll get your memory back. Okay, I'll go give my mom the drink now. Thank you. You're welcome. Mom, I'm home. Honey, where were you? I went to a friend's house. Friend? Yes, I brought you this drink. They said it's very good for the health. Okay, I'll drink it. You really think I'm this stupid? I know what you're up to. You're trying to trick me. Mom, you should drink from that bottle now. Who gave you this? Answer me. From now on, you can't go anywhere. You know what? You're the reason I'm blind. Why are you so mean to me? I'm your daughter. You asked too many questions. Come with me. Let go of me. This is the only way I can keep you from going out ever again. I have to call Chris. Hello, Chris. My mom locked me up. Okay, Amara, I'm coming there right now. Okay, I'm waiting. Amara? Chris? Hey, who's this? Grace. You? What are you doing here? Put an end to what you've done and drink from the bottle I gave to your daughter before I call the police. Okay, I'm gonna drink from it now. Amara, what's wrong with you? I remember everything. You're not my mom. Mm, mom, the food was so delicious. Can I have some more? No, you can't eat any more. You'll gain weight. No, I don't. I always take care of my body. If you gain too much weight, it can be dangerous for your health. So no more food. Why do you have to be like this? I'm so bored. Why can't I eat? See, I was right. I don't even weigh that much, even though I eat a lot. I'm going to school. Can you give me some money for food? Sure, here. But this isn't enough for food, mom. Just buy a small snack. You don't need to eat all the time. But mom, that's not going to fill me up. What did you just say? Nothing. Thanks, mom. Look, that's the girl who never gains any weight, but she eats a lot. Our school is holding a modeling competition. Who wants to join? Sir, I'd like to join, please. Are you sure you want to enter the competition? Yes, sir. Okay, please write your name on this piece of paper. Okay, thanks, sir. You must feel really lucky, huh? Lucky? What do you mean? Because you get to be a part of the modeling competition. You eat a lot, but you never gain any weight. Everyone, we have a new student. Wow, she's pretty. You'll be sitting next to Amara. Sir, I don't want to sit next to her. Whoa, that's the first time someone says they don't want to sit next to Amara. Why did she not want to sit next to me? Guys, do you want to be in the same group as me? Sorry, our group is full. Really? How come? Your group is never full. Because we're in the same group as the new girl. Yeah, and apparently she's super smart. Smarter than you. Oh, I see. In that case, I'll find another group. Babe, I'm so annoyed. You don't even know what happened today. We have to break up. Huh? Why? Because you look like a kid. Just look at your body. I'm embarrassed to be seen with you. I'd rather date the new girl. Well, at least I can still take part in the modeling competition and she can't. Sir, I'm so glad I can take part in the modeling competition later. Your opponent is Amara, right? Yes, sir. First, she steals my boyfriend and now this. I'm not going to let her win. You do know it's not easy to win that competition, Why isn't right? it easy to win? During the competition, you'll be asked to eat a lot and the one who what? does wins. But if I eat a lot, there's no way I'm not going to gain weight. I can't lose against the new girl. You want to win, right? Who are you? It doesn't matter. What matters is I'm here to help you win. 
Here, eat this. Once you eat it, your weight will stop, and no one will be able to see that you've gained weight. Okay. I wonder if she's telling the truth. Amara, where did you get that from? Some old lady gave it to me. What the heck? You can't eat that. It's really bad. If you eat it, your body will... The modeling competition will start soon. Sorry, but I have to go. I'm gonna be late. Bye! Wait! Honey, congratulations on your height. Wow, I'm pretty tall. Everyone stops at 160 centimeters when they but turn why? 16. Because after that, nobody grows anymore. Whoa, you've grown so much. Yes, I'm already 130 centimeters. I'm 140. I'm sad that we're going to stop growing. I really want it to be tall. Class, time to take measurements. Amara, you go first. 150 centimeters. Congratulations. I'm 160 centimeters tall. Happy birthday, honey. You've grown so much. Thank you, mom. Your height is 160 centimeters, just like me and your dad. Are you not happy? Yeah, I'm very happy. Oh my gosh, look. What are you guys talking about? Your height. Come with me now. We have to speak with you. Is this your mom's phone number? Yeah, that's right. I came as quick as I can. What's happening? Your daughter has not stopped growing. How is this possible? Well, we suspect that she is the daughter of... We suspect that she is the daughter of someone very tall. What's going to happen now? We're going to have to send you to a school, especially for tall people like you. You can't study with shorter people anymore. This is Amara. She'll be studying here from now on. Whoa, she's so tall. Are they also children of someone tall like me? Don't speak about that in class, okay? Why? Hey, you're so tall. Hello. Yes, I am. Why haven't you gotten your height checked yet? They didn't call me. Look at the ceiling. It's very high, isn't it? Whoa, yes it is. We can grow up to 500 centimeters. That's why we need to take our special gummies. You wanted to see me? You're new here, right? Yes. Okay, here's your gummies. Take a gummy a day to stop your growth. Did you like the book? Yeah. All students, please come for a height check. Why do they do that? Listen, Amara, if you start to grow and get stronger, they'll put you to sleep in a freezer. So, your height is 300 centimeters. It's not too bad. If you reach 500 centimeters, we're going to have to take you away. So, please remember to take your gummies. Where are they? Looking for something? <sighs> yes, I lost my gummies. You can just take one of mine. But aren't they different? I think they're all the same. Good morning. Did everyone take the gummy? Yes, sir. Okay, everyone. We're going to play a game of hide and seek. Please hide in a good place so that no one will oh, find no. you. Oh, no. I'm growing again. What's going on? She's getting taller. I'm seven meters tall. What should I do now? You must eat one of these gummies to get shorter, okay? Um, one is enough. Whoa. It's working very well. Don't eat any more. Amara, you're too short to go to school here. If you don't return to your normal height by a week, you have to leave the school. How do I get my height back? I'm sorry, but we can't help you. Oh, look how short she is. She really thought she could rule the world, but in the end, she became a shorty. Maybe I'll get taller than you. I don't even want to be tall anymore. I doubt you'll ever be tall again. Sir, please, I don't want to leave the school. You need to be at least 200 centimeters to join the school. You're much shorter than that. You can just give me some special gummies so I can grow taller. You're crazy. You should never do that. Why not? Hey, you're the one who wants to be tall again, right? Yeah, that's true. I've been researching and I found these new gummies for Thanks. growth. I just didn't work much on the formula, so there might be side effects. Whoa, it's working. Look at her. She keeps getting shorter and shorter. Soon, she'll disappear completely. Hey, I found new growth gummies. But I'm scared to try it. They're much more powerful than the others. I'm sure they're going to work. Okay.